guys what's up it's Chris and welcome back to the channel have you already subscribed if not go ahead and tap that subscribe button down below give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to hit the bell for the notifications so you're notified every time I drop new content today we're taking a ride around and I think we're going to be going to Winter Park it's a historic part of Orlando and we're gonna be having a little brunch and doing a little walking around so I'm gonna take you along with us excited to go to this spot one of the reasons I picked it is because they're very strict on like temperature checks and stuff like that I'll insert some of the reviews and I'll insert some of their guidelines all right let me finish getting ready and we'll go So tell me and be honest, you know, we are all family and y'all are not judging me. I am getting ready to go out to brunch, but I did make myself two pieces of the Trader Joe's cinnamon roll bread. I think I showed it to you guys in my haul from my previous video. That's a little bit of the um, pumpkin cream cheese. And I drizzle a little bit of honey on top. Y'all, it is so bomb. I toast the bread and while it's hot, smear, yeah, smear my cream cheese on top and then drizzle it with honey. Bomb! Like you never know, you may get to the restaurant, there's a long wait. You may get to the restaurant, the vibe is off. You may get to the restaurant and the food is not all that great. So I like to bleed with a little something on my stomach. Comment down below, do you guys do the same thing? And if you don't, don't you dare judge me. So also with making myself comfortable with going out during the new normal, that's what I'm gonna call it, cause I don't need my video flag. Of course I have mask, hand sanitizer, a mini um, Lysol, wipes. In the car, also have big things of Clorox wipes. Like, it's serious out there y'all. So in order for me to feel okay with going out, I have to arm myself and I'm constantly washing my hands and then, you know, moisturizing and stuff like that. Just pretty much staying safe, socially distancing and things like that. But I'm trying to stay as normal as I can. But you will go crazy. Comment down below. Do you guys take these extremes? Is this even extreme? Do you guys go deeper than this? And if you do, Share the tea with your booth. Let me know what else I should be doing. So this is the mask that I'm gonna be wearing today. Lightweight, but still it's um double layered. Support black businesses. This is a black owned business that I support. I have a couple from them and then, um, yeah. Anyway, let me get myself together. I don't leave home without mementos. Okay, keep the breath fresh. I'm just saying, all right, I gotta go. <laughs> you guys, so I just got presented with these at the door. So this is a beautiful start to a brunch date. I love my bouquet. All right, so. We're about to head out for real. See, good thing I had that piece of toast. Cause we still didn't leave, it started raining and everything. But y'all, I love this bouquet. So I'm gonna sit them in my vase and then um, arrange them when I get back home. All right, y'all, so we just parked. I'm gonna show you a little bit of the scenery around. It's drizzling a little bit, but still, it's a nice day. Um, and let's see what we get into. <laughs> what up, I'm getting knocked out. All right, y'all, so we got to all turned around. I'm walking around without a mask. I had to, they had to tell me like, what's going on, where's your mask? So I'm masked up y'all, and I think we're in the right direction, because we're hungry. Hey, hey. Hey, guys. So you 
you can either eat outside or inside. It was raining, so I guess we're gonna eat inside. <laughs> All right, so as with most restaurants now, they're doing um, digital menus. So here is the name of the restaurant, and it's an American style cuisine. You just hold your camera up, and then the menu will pop up for you. To what I said earlier about eating before you leave the house like putting a little something on your stomach for me the french toast was mm, it was a little bit too um overdone I guess you want to say it was dry and then my eggs as you can see like are really really well done um only one strip of bacon was actually edible to me and the other piece was a little dry Babe, steak was pretty good, but I'm not going to say that we're not going to try it again. We want to go back because we saw some of the lunch items coming out to various tables like behind us and on the side of us. And it looked really good. So we want to give them a try for like lunch. Comment down below if you've tried this restaurant and what was your favorite thing to order?
you can see, we had a very enjoyable day. Lots of hand sanitizing and social distancing. So I would say that this was a very safe day. Until next time, guys, stay safe. See you soon.